Okay, so here is my haul, my collective haul, and let me unpack it, and I'll be right back. Okay, so here are my Easter finds, and so let's get started with right here. These cute little pails, so they're metal, and look at this one. It's got flower market, it says blooms, bulbs. Country Rabbit Candy Company, Carrot Patch, Farm Fresh Eggs, super cute, oh my goodness, this is so cute, and it's all the way around, the patterns are all the way around the pail, these are so cute, with the purple, like a light lilac purple handle, and look at this, oh my goodness, here we go, here we're going to start, <laughs> looking for a place to settle <laughs> and then this other pail here so they had four different pails but I only picked up these two this one with all the rabbits and the different colors oh my goodness this is so adorable it's so cute and it's got a little pink handle on this one so like I said there were four different styles one had another one had like zigzags stripes and i don't recall what the fourth one had but these are the two that i like so these are the two that i picked up i thought they were the best ones of the four and then these are a returning item these little paint kits so this one here is the little chick and it's just ceramic painting kit so the little chick is ceramic and it brings the three color paints and a little paintbrush so that's five pieces. Doesn't say ages. So let me see. No, it doesn't say ages, but I'm thinking four or five, maybe. It's my guess. But yeah, it's up to the discretion of the parents. But isn't this so cute? The little chick. So they had the little chick. And then they had the little bunny again. There's a little bunny. Same thing. Three different colors. And I think all the colors are the same. Primary colors. And so here's a little egg. With a little design on it. And they're all ceramic. So that these are so cute. And what was really cute about these. These are super cute for a tear tray. So you can, you can paint them as you wish. And put them in your tear tray for decor. So I think those are super cute. And then these are a return turning item as well. These little peeps lip balms. Because I picked these up last year and I gave them away as gifts to some of the girls at church. And so this one is the grape. Isn't that cute? And you get, oh, come on, 0.12 ounces. And then this one is the strawberry. This one is the cotton candy. And I believe this one was the most popular one. I think the girls were like, oh, I'll trade you, I'll trade you. Yeah, I think they really liked that one. And the vanilla. So I think the favorite was definitely the cotton candy and then maybe the grape. But yeah, look how cute. So yeah, these are the four that they had. Again, they had them last year. And so I picked them up this year, and I'll probably give them as gifts as well to somebody else or other, some other ladies. And then they had these cute little tinsel baskets in several different colors. I think, well, they had this blue one, and I think a purple one, and I think a pink one, and maybe a white one, I think. I think it's four different colors. And then the little foam eggs with the glitter. So you can easily remove this tinsel. And do something else with it. I had a friend on YouTube that removed the tinsel and twined it up, which is something I would have done for sure. And I may still do it because I just love that look. And if you watched my video with some of my DIYs, uh, I believe it was the Heidi Sambal um, playlist, and I twined up a bunny. It, and it was a tinsel covered bunny. So I might. T tinsel um, I might twine this up and it'll go with my bunny 
You know what? I'll put it right here so you can see it. Just look how adorable he is. So cute. Yeah. So yeah. So if I twine this up, it'll go with my little bunny. Oh my goodness, so cute. But yeah, she did an amazing job. And I'll probably, I'll go ahead and link her video in my description box if you're interested in seeing how she did it. But yeah, these are so cute. So cute. Okay. And then they had these. These are soaps. And this one is the bunny. I've already hauled the chick. But I had not seen the bunny. And so it's just hand soap. And it's 10 ounces. So I think that's a pretty good deal. It's super cute for the kiddos to use in the bathroom. I think that's a fun item. And then I picked up two of these cute baskets. They are the fabric, kind of like the burlap on the outside and the gingham on the inside. So this is the blue gingham and it's got a handle and the handle has the same with the gingham and then the burlap same fabrics and look how cute with the ears it's got nice ears and look at the cute face and look at the nose oh my goodness the nose is a heart I'm just now noticing that oh my goodness are you serious it's a heart <laughs> and then the little girl same setup but pink but actually it's not gingham this one is a polka dot so that's super cute I like that they did them a little bit different Oh, I'm just now noticing that too. Super cute. And so the handle's the same thing. Yeah, super cute. And the little nose the same. But they're pretty good size. I mean, look at that. And you can fill these up with flowers. You know, silk flowers, full flowers. You can fill you could put a potted plant in there. You can of course fill it up with eggs. Really anything. Yeah, to decorate your house. I think they're super cute so I'll set those over there and then over here look at these cute little socks that I found <gasps> are you kidding me look they have little ears and it's not just little ears look how soft they're, you could you could tell how, so how soft these are these are so cute so these are like little bears with like a aqua I don't know what that is aqua aqua stripe I don't know but cute so these are the women's sizes five to five to nine and then this one is my favorite oh my goodness you guys are gonna die look at this it's a bunny and look at the little ears what and it's it's like I don't know if you can tell but it's kind of like a like a soft micro like a microfiber yeah, it's kind of got that thickness, that texture, but super soft. So it's like microfiber ears, and then the sweet little face, and the little Z's because he's taking a nap. Or she, she's taking a nap. I see pink. So it's a she. And again, these are for women. Sizes 5 and 9. Super cute. And then we'll bring this over here. And these are the... They call them the Easter eggs, six piece, but they're actually little trucks. So in one of my previous hauls, I picked up the cars, and then these are the little trucks. So you get purple, green, blue, yellow, orange, and a good, nice, hot pink. So look how cute. Now I know my grandsons are gonna love this and I'll probably give the pink one to my granddaughter, the pink one and the purple one to her and give the boys these here. So yeah, I picked up a couple packs of these and, and also of course the cars, which are in one of my previous hauls. So yeah, so cute. Dollar Tree's killing it this year with the Easter. So I picked up this cute little sign. It says this chick's ready. For Easter with the cute little chicky and the kind of like the shiplap look and it's just hollow in the back so you can DIY this if you want to and this one's actually missing the little hanger it looks like it's supposed to be a little hanger but that's okay I probably would have removed it anyway if I'm gonna DIY it so they did me a favor they helped me out 
Okay, so now we're going to go into signs. Signs galore. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Let me turn these around. So I found, let me move these little cars because they're a little bit noisy. Okay. So I found these little truck signs and they kind of have the shipwreck look on these as well. It's just this one says carrot patch, pick your own, 25 cents, locally grown, open daily with the truck and the glitter. And I see a little bit of glitter on my finger. So, hmm, but not too bad. I mean, it's not a lot. It's just a little bit. So, and then the little carrots. But you can use the back of it and DIY this if you want. Because it's a nice shape. It's got the shape of like the shiplap. The panels. Or the planks. And then here's the pink one. And this one says Cottontail Farms. Let's move this. Cottontail Farms. Open daily. A one dollar dozen. With the eggs. And the pink truck. And this one is not that bad. Yeah, I don't see any glitter actually on this one. And it says, this way to the bunny trail. Oh, so cute. And then look, what? These are the gnomes, the gnome signs. Okay, so they had three different ones, but the blue one, I could not reach. It was up too high. And there were a lot of people around, and so I just gave up. Yeah, I gave up. <laughs> I figured, you know what, I'll just get these two and I'm just going to take off. But look how cute. This one's the pink one, pink hat. It's got like a chevron hat. Cute little nose. It says, welcome. Cute little Easter eggs. This one with the zigzags. This one's with the polka dot and the stripes. And this one's with the polka dots. Look how adorable. This is cute. Let me see the glitter. Always got to check on the glitter. Oh, yep, yep. Mm-hmm. I see glitter. Oh, boy. Okay, well, you know, it is what it is. A little bit of hairspray should help it. And then this one. This one is my favorite. So this one's got the purple hat with the polka dots. And, of course, the glitter. Well, you know what? Let me see. Uh, yeah, yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> but it's my favorite because he's holding a chocolate bunny. What? Look at that. He's holding a little chocolate bunny. Happy Easter. Oh my goodness. Doesn't that just make you melt? Oh my goodness. That's so cute. And then the pink egg with the polka dot and then the blue egg with the stripes. Oh my goodness. Now if I do see the blue one, I will pick it up. Um, hopefully it'll be within my reach because I am vertically challenged and my hubby was not with me that day. So yeah, that's that <laughs> and the <of> story. <laughs> and then they had this one Easter greetings with the little um, corrugated galvanized bunny. And they had this one last year, but I do not remember it having the galvanized bunny. I remember it had the picture of the galvanized bunny, like the graphic of it. But it didn't have this 3D like actual piece that you can remove. So yeah, this is an actual, you see it? It's an actual piece of corrugated galvanized metal on here. And if you look closely, the, the graphic is underneath it. And that's the one I remember last year with the, just the graphic. But look how cute. And then I found it as well in the pink. Oh, and I didn't check the glitter. Let me see. Let's check the glitter. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. <laughs> and then the same thing with this. See, this is an actual galvanized piece. It's pretty cute with the burlap bow. Yeah, this one had the burlap bow as well. And then this one's got the five Easter eggs. Pink one. A yellow one purple one kind of an orange one or is that red that might be red and then a blue one I like that blue one I like the swirl on that that's pretty and again this has like the ship black look with the slants or slats or whatever you want to call it 
and then they had a few different ones of these and so when I went the the lady that was stocking everything up she was she had just put these out and I was kind of waiting for her to put out the rest but she, she, I think she was I think she saw that I was waiting so she was taking her time so I just left so I only got this one but they did have I think three total three different ones three or four different ones but this one's super cute too because it's got the raised embellishments on it and the little burlap bow but if I do find the others next time I go I'll pick them up for sure but look how cute and they're pretty good size and they have the stakes on the bottom so you could put them in the ground outside or you could put them in some floral foam in a pot indoors or on your porch or yeah you can do so much with these they're super cute and then these are back again these little bunny forms and so they're wood they're that balsa wood and so these are definitely for DIYing you can do a lot with these I've seen people carve them with fabric I've seen people paint them I've seen people stain them. Yeah, there's, there's a lot you can do with these. So this might be coming up in a DIY. I have a couple ideas. That does not include paint, does not include fabric. It's, it's gonna be to totally different. Oh, and not twine either. <laughs> but we'll see, we'll see if it works. So maybe stain, we'll see. But anyway, yeah, cute. And it's just the same on the other side. Super cute. And so now for these longer signs, we'll start with this one, this chicky is on top. So this, this, this chicky, and look at that. You can see the wood grain on it. Kind of has like a, a veneer because this is definitely MDF. You could tell it's MDF. So it just has a veneer, a wood veneer on it. And look how cute. They did this really well. Pretty colors, pretty um, styles and patterns. Little burlap bow on a super long steak. Very, very, very cute. Oh my goodness, this is super cute. And then the bunny. They did the bunny the same way with that wood veneer and the nice graphic on it. This one's holding a carrot that says welcome. The burlap bow and a nice long <clears throat> excuse me and a nice long steak I'm thinking about let me see does it say no but I'm thinking the steak itself maybe two feet I don't know I'm guessing and then they had this one the little truck so this little truck they had it in two forms they had it in on the steak like this nice like two feet long steak they had it on this and then they also had it as a sign but I picked up the signs last year and I think I still have them so I didn't pick up the signs again this year but they're exactly like this piece here it's, it's the same truck with the same happy Easter sign it's just in a hanging sign and not a steak so this is the pink truck with the glitter wheels or tires the little bunny booty with this little tail popping up and the little eggs with different um, like different styles and patterns it looks like it's got let me see it looks like it has the burlap but no that's just that's just I guess a graphic because there's no texture there but there's definitely texture in the glitter and then there's of course texture on the little bunny tail super cute so they had this one and then the blue version the same thing but this one it's got little carrots in the back instead of the eggs and again happy Easter with the blue and then the sign and then the long steak same as the pink one and then they had these this one says this one's a cute bunny with googly eyes and a cute little nose oh I like the whiskers the whiskers are super cute and this one says bunny please stop here the little sign with like a is that a hexagon one two three four yeah 
with a hexagon shape. And again, MDF on a stake. And then the blue version, same exact thing. Just has a blue hexagon and blue stake. And then these long signs. This one says just Happy Easter with the glitter and a little bit of floral up top. It's like a rose, some roses. And then the shiplap. I think the shiplap on this is really nice. It's got a pretty cute little pattern on it. And of course the glitter. Yeah. <laughs> and then the pink one. Here's the pink version. Same thing. The roses. Happy Easter. So yeah. So this is what I found for Easter this time around. And let me put this away and I'll be right back with spring and summer. And we'll go from there. So I'll be right back. Okay, so here are the spring and summer finds that I found this time around. So we'll start over here with these cute napkins. So these are the Spring Fling um, collection. And they are 16 napkins in the pack. And look, look how cute. They have like a scallop edge on them. And with little hummingbirds. And these are, they look like peonies maybe. And poppies, maybe I'm not really sure, but look how adorable! Oh, a little butterfly! So, these are really, really cute! Really cute. And then this one here says Hello Spring with a little wheelbarrow and flowers, and a watering can, and garden tools, and a pot, and little ladybugs. Really cute, super cute. And this one you get 14 guest napkins. The Spring Fling Collection. So I picked up a pack of these. And I might, what I might use these for, I might use these for Mod Podging onto a project. So that might be coming up. And then they had this cute set. And this is a banner. Again, the Spring Fling Collection. And so it's a cute little banner that says welcome. I don't know if you can see it. It says welcome spring. And so here's a W. And it's got a little bit of glitter. But hopefully it won't be too messy. And this looks like burlap, but it's not. This is just a graphic. There's no texture to this. There's a little bit of texture on the glitter portion. But that's about it. Oh, look, it's got a green ribbon. Okay. But it's cute. I think it's cute. And then... Oh, and then they had these cute little silver wire LED lights. I've picked up the copper ones before, and the copper ones have like a, like a warm glow. But I've never been able to find the silver wire ones, and these have a cool glow. So I found these. So I picked up two packs. But if you, as you can see, they have silver wire instead of the warm copper one. And they take two AA batteries. And the battery pack is a little bit big. I can't see it from here. Well, let me go ahead and take one out to show you guys. Okay, so here's the battery pack. So it's pretty, it's pretty big size. I kind of prefer the Amazon Fairy Lights only because... It's got a little tiny little battery pack and the battery is actually included but for a dollar you can't beat this these are super cute too so they are cute it's a good deal so if you see them hey yeah they're super cute okay so let's set these aside i found some more succulents and i really like this style so i picked up three of these same styles and these actually come with an alligator clip. So see, it's an alligator clip. Yes, that's what it's called. <laughs> it's an alligator clip. And it just says succulent clip from the floral garden section. So this is a floral garden, as you can see. And then they had these magnolias. Look at these. 
So they had these in the pale blush pink and cream color. And they also had them with a like a brighter pink. But I really like this kind of neutral look. It's got a little bit of yellow, but it's fine. And it's got that green, but it's good. But these are cute. So I picked up two, two picks of the magnolias. And then they had these. Look at this. These are the wisteria. The wisteria. And look how nice these are. These are so long. So I picked up two purple and a pink. These are so pretty. Can you imagine putting this in a hanging vase? Wow, these are beautiful. And the stems are really long. Look at this. They are long. Yes, and the leaves are not bad. They're pretty good too. And then my last piece for this section, which is actually, doesn't really belong in this section, but it's, it's a summer piece. And it's just this pineapple that's all tinseled up with tinsel garland. You know that's coming off. Yep, we'll be doing something with this. Probably not twine, but something. But it's got, it does have a cute little summer, um, like wood letter, lettering, little sign, cute little summer sign on it. It is a paper sign though. It's not wood and it's not galvanized metal. Nevertheless, it's cute and you can paint it. If you can remove it without ruining it, you can definitely paint it and reuse it. And so the back is just raw as can be, but you can see the frame of the pineapple. Yeah, so, and this, this garland is real easy to, to remove as well. So we'll definitely be doing something with this. But that'll be coming up for sure. Okay, so I'll be right back and I'm bringing the makeup, the kitchen items, and we'll go from there. Okay, so these are the items that I picked up from the kitchen section and the makeup section. So we'll start this side this time. And so this oven mitt says bloom where you are planted and I believe I picked up the pot holders last time and I think one of these so I picked up another one and this one I think I missed out on but I did get the pot holders excuse me can I help you <laughs> so this one says let your dreams blossom but it's super cute so this one on the back has got this bluish color and this one's got the pink and then this one that says here comes spring and it's got the green and then this one is new too this one says love builds a happy home and it's got this the gray so these four and then as far as makeup I found this cute uh, it's like a matte lip color and it says tube indicates the color so this is a Broadway, and it says lip lacquer. Yeah, not lipstick. Ooh, lip lacquer. Hmm, sounds interesting. So matte lip lacquer by Broadway. Never tried this, so we shall see. I may do a review on it, but I love the color. It kinda goes with my nails. I'm a pink girl as far as lipstick and nail polish. And as well as this one, look at this. This is a, this is a fantastic color. This one's a Wet n Wild. If my camera will focus, here we go. Wet n Wild Pump, keep going. What? Wait a minute. Okay, Wet n Wild Pump, keep going. And it says waterproof, sweatproof, eyeshadow. Oh, this is eyeshadow? Oh, I thought it was lipstick. <laughs> so a pink eyeshadow, really? Okay, that's gonna be interesting. Let me see here. Maybe it's just the cap color. It says mud run. Let me see, I gotta open this up. I gotta open this, I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the color. Let me see if we can get focus. So it's like a bronze color. 
that's pretty and here I, I swatched it on my wrist so it's like a bronzy shimmery color okay well you know what I was deceived I thought it was a lip color and I thought it was this color but you know what I'm not mad at it that's this color is pretty too so if you see these yeah, yeah make sure to read it when I saw that it said pump I don't know I thought I thought it was lipstick but that's okay so now you know now I know so <laughs> okay okay so these I know I wasn't deceived these are eyeliners and I love eyeliners and so these are the smudge proof slim felt tip and they're by LA colors and this one is the black and this one is the blue and they also had a brown but I don't use brown I'll use blue and I definitely use black like all the time and then this last one is a setting spray and it comes in clear LA colors so it says set your makeup on the go so I'll pick this up perfect for travel it's just a little pump so it's just a little pump so that's cute all right I'll be right back I'm going to bring in the crafting items and the home decor items okay so here are the crafters square and jot items that I picked up it's not a lot because I already have quite a few of those items here at home so I only picked up the items that I had not picked up before so here let's start with stickers look at these these are so cute they're iridescent -y. like they look like perfume bottles I think they're perfume bottles but I love the shape I love the colors I love the transparency and, the, and they, they're called foil so these are foil stickers and you get 13 in this pack and then this one here is a, it doesn't say what type, but I'm thinking these are transparent ones. You get 10 in a pack. And this one says, awesome, call me, hello, happy, enjoy, rock, okay. And an arrow with some stars. Super cute. And then these are rub-on transfers. So these you rub on. And it doesn't say how many because there's quite a few. And so here you have some unicorns, some rabbits, some hummingbirds, some flowers, swans, raccoons, crane, and is that, are those foxes? Maybe? Foxes, fish. This is super cute. And I really like the colors on it. It's a really nice color combination. So I got these, just one pack. I didn't want to get too greedy. So I just got one. And then this is another rub-on transfer. And this one is so, so, um, what is it? Shabby chic? Yeah, shabby chic. And again, this one doesn't say how many, but it has teacups and some letters and some labels, and some roses, and birds, and packages, and uh, scrolls with quills, more flowers, more teacups, butterflies, hearts, more birds. Oh my goodness, this is so, so cute, so vintage looking. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this, this is a dollar. I just cannot believe it. This is just so well made. I mean, look at the detail. Look at that. That is really good. Look at that. The detail is fantastic. From Paris with love. Look at the stamp. Wow. That is cute. Look at this. I have friends here. I have friends. Yes, my friends. My babies. They're so nosy. Oh, no. You're not coming over here. Go. Go on. <laughs> And there it goes. Oh my goodness. Okay. And then these are stickers. And I like the font. I think the font is really cute. And these are the silver. But you can always paint these as well if you want to. And they're just called foil. 
but I think these are super cute. So I got one pack of these. And then they had a lot of the laser cuts again, but these are the ones, these I picked up before. These are actually not new. This one I've never picked up before, so I picked up this one. And this one has the fish, the angel fish, the polar bear, and the dolphins. And you get two of each style. So a total of six. And then these I picked up again because I just love the keys. So these are keys. And they're all different styles of keys. So they're really cute. And I used one of these keys for a decor piece. So maybe I'll link it over here so if you want to see it. So this is a boho inspired wall hanging. But it came out super cute. So this is so, so cute. So I got those two packs. And then I picked up a large bottle of this Aileen's Turbo Tacky Glue. And let me tell you, I love the Aileen's regular tacky glue, especially for adhering wood to wood. It works really well. And this one's turbo, so hmm, very interesting. And you get four fluid ounces. This is a pretty good size bottle because the regular tacky glue is like literally like this size. So this is like, you get almost half more. So that's a really good deal. I probably should have grabbed two bottles. If I see it again, I definitely will grab another one because these are definitely worth it. I love this glue. And then picked up two of these little notebooks and they're really cute. These are by Jot and you get 60 sheets per little notebook and it even brings a little pen. So these are great to put in your car, to jot down things. Um, you know, really you can do a lot with these little notepads, these little, and I'm thinking this is like magnetized. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and open one and see. Okay, so here's one open, and no, this is not magnetized. This is just a, like a pattern, a decor piece. So it just opens like this, and so you have the paper, which is lined, and it's got a little bookmark, and it has the little pen. This is super cute for a dollar. Yes, this is really cute. So I got the black and I got a pink. So one for hubby and one for myself. So I got two of those. And I got this cute pen. This was actually in the fun find section. And it's just called Hourglass Pen. But I thought this was kind of fun because it's got the sand and so if you're bored. Yeah, look. And it actually works. The sand fills. Let's see if you can see it. See the sand is spilling down. <laughs> Go back up. Let's see if you can see it. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, you can see it. Isn't that cute? That is so cute. And if trouble will get off my truck, I can show you my truck. Come on, need to go. Excuse me. Excuse me. And we'll come back to the truck. Okay. So also these cute little chunky brushes. And last time I picked up the natural bristle brushes. They were like chippy brushes. These are more uh, shaped. But I kind of like these kind of brushes. I have a few of the plaid brushes with this kind of um, brush uh, brush head or I don't know what you call it brush top I don't know brush <laughs> but I really like this kind so I'm, I'm thinking these are gonna work really well for my some of my painting so you get three in a pack crafter square super cute and then pick up one of these jots pair of scissors and I like the pattern on them it says soft grip handles and it doesn't say how long stainless steel blades doesn't say how long oh yeah it does so it says lightweight premium scissors seven and a half inches so that's pretty good pretty good and then over here, oh my goodness, these boys, they're just so jealous. It's like anytime I do anything, they want to be like in it. 
So I picked up these cute little twine colors, these little spools of twine. And so this one is um, Simply, what is it, Hans? No, Simply Home, sorry. Simply Home, cotton twine, 100% cotton crafting string, and you get 180 square feet, or 80, no, I'm sorry. You get 180 feet, and this one is in the royal blue, and then this one is in the blue and white pattern. Same thing, 180 feet, cotton twine, and this one is in the bright yellow, and the same thing. And I gotta show you the truck if this boy will get off. <laughs> He's serious. <laughs> okay, so they had these wood trucks again, but look, this one is plain. It doesn't have any pumpkins, it doesn't have any hearts, it doesn't have any um, eggs or Christmas trees or anything it's just plain so you really you can do whatever you want with these you can put whatever you like on these trucks and then again they're that balsa wood so it's thin it's not mdf it's actual wood but these are super cute so i just got one of them they didn't have very many out they had oh look this is this is not even centered oh i'm just noticing that but i'm thinking this probably come off easy maybe I think so. I've removed um, pieces off these wood items as well. So if I can do a gingerbread house and remove windows, I can remove a, a hubcap <laughs> off the tire, off the wheel. So we'll see. We'll see what I do with this. Ah, this boy. Okay, now I'll be right back with the home decor. If this boy will let me. I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, so here are the home decor pieces that I picked up, and we'll start over here with this one. So I picked up the other three that are part of this collection. There was a one that said, This Is Us, and one that said, Bless My Blessed Nest, and I think there was another one, unless I'm thinking of this one. So anyway, I picked up the home one. I had not picked up this one. So here's the home one, and it it's got like a wood word that says home and this is easy to remove so it's easy to DIY look at this you're not gonna believe this but these kids look at this they're just everywhere they're everywhere <laughs> it's like they miss mama anyway I picked this up because I thought it was super cute I like that it says home I like the color I like the embellishments on it, the shiplack look on the inside, and again, this is easy to DIY as well, so that's a plus. But I'll probably leave this one alone, and I'll probably DIY the one that says this is us, because the this is us words are all jumbled together, and so I'm not crazy about the way that looks, but I'll leave this one alone and DIY the other one, if that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> anyway, they had these new... Uh, wall decor pieces and it's really cute about these it's got like a wood look and then on the other side it's got like a marble look with a galvanized word that says welcome and I don't think this comes off you know what it might yeah it's got it's, it's raised so it might come off but I don't know if I would take it off I, I kind of like the way it looks I like the color blocking on it and this is MDF and it just says decor and it's got a little hanger on it. So this is the hexagon welcome sign. This is the round family sign and I love the way family is written on here. This is so cute. It's like a messy script but it's really cute. And the little hanger MDF and then this one looks like two triangles like mountains. And again, the same, some wood look and marble look. This one says dreaming with the raised lettering. MDF with the little hook, the little hanger. So these three, and I only saw three, three, three types. I picked up one canvas art 
And this one says sort, wash, fold. So this will probably go in my laundry room for sure. With a laundry basket with some towels. Looks like towels. We always have towels in the laundry room. <laughs> and then this cute little welcome. Oh my goodness, it's like a wire wreath. And it's a gold. So this could be painted. You can paint paint it white. You can paint it black. But I like the welcome, how it's, it's in a script with the wire. Let's remove this out of the way so you can see it better. Look at that. That is so cute. That is adorable. And it's got a little hanger, so you can actually just hang it. It's got a saw tooth hanger. Very cute. Very cute. You can also put like a jute twine and hang it that way if you want to. But this is really cute. And then as far as banks, I found this one, Rainy Day Fund. I've picked up the other ones that they had. But this is cute to give away to maybe one of the kids. So they can save their money for a rainy day. You could also DIY these as well. These come off real easy. They pop right off and open up. And you can remove this, which I think the font is cute as it is. But you can change the paper because the paper in the back looks like, well, I guess it's supposed to be rainy day. So I guess that goes with it. But, you know, if it doesn't go with your decor, you can change it up for sure. So that's an idea. And then they had these really cute ones, these little smaller frames. This one says, hello, love. And these are easy to open up. And you can change out the word inside. You can paint it. This one says Adventure is Calling. The same thing. There we go. Same thing. So really cute. And then last but not least. Oh my goodness. I was so impressed with this. Look at this. This one says Hello Beautiful with some beautiful lashes. And it's on a little um, kickstand. But look. It lights up. What? So look at this. So you can see the wire lights. And it's got like a little battery thing. So let's pull it out. Oh, look at that. That is cute. Oh, that is so cute as it is. Maybe on a makeup table or vanity. Or you can also DIY this as well. And look at this. It's so cute. And I'm sure it turns off. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Operator error. Okay. So look. It's just, it's called Tabletop Decor. Oh, so this is a Fun Finds one. Yeah, this is Fun Finds. Okay. But isn't this sweet? Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, that's my haul for today. It was a little bit lengthy. Um, it's about 75 different pieces and I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give me a thumbs up I would really appreciate it and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet and share with your friends share all the new finds and until my next video I hope you all stay healthy safe and strong and have a great great day bye bye